Democrats are feeling more confident about the race for Congress in New Jersey's 5th District. Dennis Shulman, a political novice who's legally blind, is challenging three-term Republican Scott Garrett. As Zachary Fink reports, the surge in Barack Obama's candidacy is putting races within reach for the Democrats that were once safely in Republican column. <laughs> Democrat Dennis Shulman was in a good mood this morning when we met him at his campaign office. Once a long-shot candidate, Shulman now says he's confident they're closing the gap against Scott Garrett. Not only has the Democratic uh, Party been very interested in the race by putting us up to what they call red to blue, their highest ranking, but even there was a, uh, even the Republican Party has ranked Garrett Scott Garrett as one of the most vulnerable seats in the United States House of Representatives. Last month, a poll commissioned by the Daily Coast Democrat-leaning website showed Garrett handily beating Shulman 49 to 34 percent. But just last week, those numbers shifted. The same poll shows Garrett ahead by only seven points in a district that has voted overwhelmingly Republican in the last two congressional elections. Analysts say many Republicans in different races have been hurt by the financial crisis. Garrett sits on the Financial Services Committee in the House. Scott Garrett has been a major spokesman against the regulation of the financial markets and the, particularly the regulation of the housing mortgage industries. My name is Scott Garrett. Garrett made a campaign stop with seniors this afternoon. After his speech, he spoke with voters and even had time to eat a cookie. But when we attempted to speak with him, Garrett and his aides told us there was no time. Congressman, just two quick questions. We really don't have next, time. Next time. Okay. Can't do it? No. no, sorry. Real quick? No. <laughs> President Bush's approval ratings are at record and even historic lows. And polls have shown that John McCain's campaign has failed to make traction among independent voters he will need to win a majority. In fact, McCain is even defending some traditional red states. That has changed some basic assumptions. And Democrats are thinking for congressional races that they have chances in districts that were previously not in play. But that doesn't mean it's the case for this particular race. The 5th Congressional District stretches over the northern portion of the state, cutting through four counties. It is generally considered a Republican stronghold. In the last presidential race, John Kerry lost to President Bush here by 14 points. But at least one poll has shown Barack Obama and John McCain even, or at least, within the margin of error. Everything's changing, but let's be clear about when you say it's a Republican district. The person who occupied the seat in the House of Representatives for 30 years was Marge Rockema. Marge Rockema was not Scott Garrett. Zach, Marge Rockema was a moderate Republican. Shulman has also slammed Garrett for a direct mail piece accusing him of trying to appease Hamas and Iran. Shulman is not only a practicing Jew, but a rabbi. Zachary Fink, NJN News, Allendale.